Thank you for welcoming us here. Hopefully everyone's gotten a chance to take a peek upstairs. As Ginny just said, it's kind of like a special tree house here. Very neat. So, oh, somebody's coming. You can hop in, come on over. I am Sarah Regan from the Lafayette Chamber. And once again, thank you. And I'm gonna turn it over to our mayor, Carl Enduri. Well, this is a wonderful occasion today. And uh, Kim, on behalf of the Lafayette City Council, it's my pleasure to welcome you to Lafayette and to wish you every success. You know, I have to say, and I hope I'm not stealing your thunder here, but the last three ribbon cuttings have been women-owned enterprises. <laughs> and it's such a great thing for Lafayette. So welcome. And now I'm going to turn it over to Rebecca Troxell, president of the chamber. Thank you. You did not steal my thunder. There's no way you could steal my thunder. But I agree with our mayor. It's really, really awesome. I'm Rebecca Troxell. I'm the current board uh, president for the chamber here. I'm very proud to be representing this very female-dominated chamber this year. <clears throat> And really, 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 really happy to be at this ribbon cutting celebrating not just a female operated business, but a African American owned business as well that takes absolute wonderful care of our skin, our health, our wellness. I'm a big fan of health and wellness and Kim is definitely all about that herself and we're very, very lucky to have such a robust business here in Lafayette. Thank you so much. All right, so we're gonna do a quick photo with the ribbon. First, we're gonna take a picture, just holding the ribbon, not cutting it. Then we'll take a picture cutting it. And then we're gonna give a, Kim a few moments so that she can talk to everybody and tell us a little bit more about this wonderful place she has here. All right, okay, so, um, so we're gonna have some assistance from the front row here. We're gonna have some folks with this banner. And so, Kim, these are the scissors. They are real scissors. Oh, yeah, mom down. All right, and then we're gonna also have y'all hold this ribbon. Hold it as tight as. So hold this one down just a smidge. Hold this down a little bit lower. There we go. Kim, what we're gonna have you do is just open it and pretend like you're cutting it. We're gonna count to three, but it's don't cut it. No, no, come on. Okay. No, and just be careful. He'll move, he's gonna move the camera over to where Sarah is. Yeah, super um, sharp. You wanna cut it in like the, the base of the scissors as well. It's gonna be sharper when you when you go to cut it. But oh, you can fake cutting it. Like no, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. There you go. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, will you just let Katie? Can That's what I was thinking. A little bit okay. more. Sorry. Okay. Thank, you for you. Thank you, AJ. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. On three, we're gonna yell congratulations. One, two. Three. Congratulations! Awesome. All right, and now we're gonna cut it for real, so I'm gonna take this banner away here. And then what we'll do is, Dennis, do you wanna count down from three? I'll be glad to. Dennis' face will count down. What a beautiful And I will go to the right. Gorgeous! Are we going to count down? And you cut it down when I get to one. Okay. Three, two, one! <laughs> All the way at the base. <laughs> the base, the base. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, I know that. Uh, okay. okay. Everybody, while they're here, and then you can take them up and show. I'm right. give you that. You just hold that. You don't need to hold it up to your mouth okay. or anything. All right. Everybody, thank you very much for coming. Thank you all the board members. Thank you my friends, some of my associates, and my mom is here. I'm gonna give you more of my spill upstairs, but I just wanna say thank you. I've been here now. Um, we came during COVID, it was really hard for me from Pleasant Hill. Things were shut down. We didn't know how we were gonna just make it and continue on. I came here, I rented a room out of there with Sherry. She also owns Shape over here. This is a whole plethora of beauty wonderland here. Mm -hmm. We got Jenny over here. She does massage. We got acupressure over here. Miss Corinne, she was over here. Now she's over there by um, on the other side. We just have a plethora of beauty here. Um, I actually am an esthetician. I've been an esthetician now for 26 years. I started as a makeup artist with Mary Kay Cosmetics back in the day. And uh, I started with brides. And so from there, I had my first place in Orinda. Then from there, mom, remember Walnut Creek, then Orinda. We built it up for 10 years, 
And then from there, back to Walnut Creek, Pleasant Hill, and now Lafayette. So hopefully this is where I retire. I know I look like I'm only 21, <laughs> but I got, you know, but it's just nice. So I offer, for, for those of you who have to leave, we do facials, clinical facials, massage therapy, professional makeup. Miss Lori Sato, a very good client of mine. She's been with me for about almost 20 years when I was in Orinda, which was nice. Melanie, yeah, we got Miss Wanda here. Miss Wanda here actually was one of my first clients. She was my banker back in the day when I started in Walnut Creek. She's been with me ever since. We got Melanie here, her whole family here. So of almost 20 years, one of the things that I love when you do your business right, when you love what you do and with God at your side and clients and you give your all, clients will stay with you. That's what the name of the game is. And I've been able to do that, to be able to provide an excellent service, but more importantly, to love my clients, but to continue with my craft, to continue to brand. And so now I'm doing executive business coaching. So I do that as well. But back to during COVID, it was really, really hard. So I had to come up with other ways to make it. So I went into executive coaching. I started doing online courses. And so I am a holistic um, practitioner as well. So now we mix beauty and business. <laughs> and I have women look gorgeous from the inside out. Thank you. So we have some um, grand prizes that we're doing, all, some of my most signature uh, treatments, the back facial, the, uh, we're doing a, the, uh, we got the back facial, oh my God, I coined that 20 something years ago, because a lot of women, you know, we need to, we need to work on our backs to keep our backs looking sexy. So that's one of my signature ones. I got microdermabrasion and hot stone massage because no one does a hot stone massage like Two Gorges. And so we took it up 10 notches and we add some hot stones with the massage. So that's what we're doing. Um, and then also my makeup artist, that's my playground. I started, I love it. And then my brand product. So I'm a little bit different esthetician. So I brand my skincare, my makeup line, and also my body line. And so thank you very much, y'all. We got plenty of food upstairs, please come back. Oh, and the most important thing, <laughs> my clients, we started this when I was in Orinda. They would come in, only do it for the evening clients. I would give them a glass of wine. Maybe that's what kept them coming back. <laughs> and so, so I branded my own two gorgeous red wine. I had Winty Winery making it for me years ago, and then they stopped. And so now I picked up another company, which is um, a company that is in Napa Valley. So now my wines are made by Napa Valley. I'm so excited. So we got white, we got red, and we got champagne. All right. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Anybody have any questions? I'm going to do a demonstration upstairs in just one minute. Anybody got any questions? All right, that's it. Welcome. All right, I'm gonna take a photo of this. This is 